We saw movement last night. We've seen a bit of movement early on. What a start for Sussex. As they saw the stumps and the bales fly, that is an excellent delivery from Robinson. The movement off the seam. Joffre Archer was put back. Well, he, he's not going to stop that. What a shot. Little bit over pitched. And he gets rid of that right leg and hits through the line. This will be not more than one. He shouted yes, one. This is going to run away for a boundary. There is a few Lancashire supporters around, but it's quite quiet. Wicked. Doesn't matter where he's bowling at the moment. Keaton Jennings is just dealing in boundaries, catching the crowd as well. Simpson standing up. In the air, Joffre Archer will try and get underneath it. He won't, and this will be a couple of bounces. A good shot from Hurst, he's a good player. Now then, does this come off his pads? I think it does. Simmer a little bit of movement. Right, he's been able to do what you would expect a left arm seamer to do. Oh. Keep it tight, but this is a deflection off the pad. Matty Hurst trying to give himself some space. Smashed. Seriously good start, start to his innings that just went across similar to how Sam Curran did it yesterday and just yes! slower delivery chip to Joffre Archer taken which meant that he couldn't get the power his hands were away from him and Joffre Archer was never going to drop this just making sure reverse hands and Brad Curry very, very good this evening. His second. Up the hill from the sea end. Wow. That's a good shot. That is a serious shot from Keaton Jennings. He doesn't mind the three down. He's going to keep going. So make the most of that new ball. <laughs> Nicely. Oh, hammered. Absolutely hammered. He plays with such. Aggression and poise when he hits down the ground. Wide base. 30. Gone! The stumps are rattled again, and you can see that Ollie Robinson. It's really full, or maybe it didn't, maybe it just hit the ground. It's just gone straight past and cannoned into those stumps. Hey! Gone again, would you believe it? Stumps are rattled once again. Pace on, didn't pick it up, but makes it more problems. Catch it! Tom Catch Hartley it. hasn't found the middle of the bat, he has found the hands. On it. Reverse, nicely played. He didn't get all of it, but he was in a good enough position to help the ball on its way. Welcome boundary. Oh. Has that done enough? Yes, it has. James Coles. Plenty of variations. And that is brilliantly timed down the ground. One bounce for Liam Livingston. Absolutely, and go he does. We've just seen a boundary straight down the ground. One bounce for this time. Well, that sounded very good off the bat, and that will go all the way. That has been bludgeoned straight back past. He's going to let loose and try and thump it as hard as he can with those quick hands. He's not got all of that. Well, this has split the two fielders out there. That is a high class shot from Liam Livingston. Well, Fuller this time and Liam Livingston hasn't even looked because he knew straight away the contact off the bat was that good. And again, he just manages to find the gap. We've just seen a big, big boundary, but now he has just been able to split the field again. And there is the call, direct hit. He could be in trouble, and this is going to be close. Liam Livingston wanted the run, but he was sent back, perhaps rightly so, but he could be short here.
okay, I'm ready for a decision. That'll do from Jofra Archer. Went back to a length. One outside the off stump, one outside the leg stump, full and straight, smashes middle stump. And two wickets for Jofra Archer back in the Sussex colours, first time for three years. And delight for the home team, the home crowd. Pulled and pulled beautifully to get Sussex off with the, the run chase with a boundary. Slapped over the offside, a couple of bounces. You want to try and make sure that... Just one bounce. A little bit shorter that from Wood. Now, does he get a little nick? Does he get a nick? Oldridge coming now. Roll it through. Keep rolling, keep rolling. OK, there's a clear gap decision of not out. You're on screen now. Good decision on field. Review burned by Lancashire. They had to gamble. Somewhat throughout the course of this summer. Short, and this is hit over the infield. A couple of bounces and run away. But width on offer and too short from Mahmood. Oh, misfield. Straight through this, and another boundary. Lancashire don't need this. The Sussex fans are enjoying it, though. Into the final day. Nice shot. This will get past Stephen Croft. It's getting better and better for Sussex. <laughs> Hit past short, fine leg, and deep square leg, another boundary. Smashed off the edge, over third, who was up in the circle. Sliced out towards that deep man, caught in the end. Little bit of a fumble. Just sliced off the face, skewing away, and nicely done. Strong left hand, just above the blades. Through the offside for another boundary. A little bit aerial from Clark. Back past Luke Wood. It was half a chance. And so. It's been whipped out over the head of deep backward square. George Dockrell there could do nothing about it. Change of angle and no change of result. There's two less this time, only four. One bounce. Four more. That will end the power play on a very good note for the Sussex Sharks. 63 for one after six <laughs> overs. Hold him. That one's gone back through the gate. And the end of Hughes. Does that give Lancashire a little bit of hope? 60 miles an hour. One was 47. I fancy this one was nearer 47, but actually it's just followed him. Perhaps expecting the ball. Was close to mid wicket and Keaton Jennings. Launch. Up and over the top. Might just plug. It does. That but... Finishing the group stages. Into space. I heard something on the stump microphones. And you mentioned about player availability. Almost there now. Just clipped away with effortless ease, really. It's one to win. And Sussex book their place at Edgebaston for the sixth time. They will be there. They join Surrey.